Hey guys, Captain Pound LP here. Welcome to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Master Quest Edition. In the last episode, well, we just about got here to the boss area. We're almost there, but right now we're kind of like, um, almost, um, we got one less puzzle to solve, mostly. <laughs> but, so far in this. Now, this is another post-commentary episode, so mind you, this is going to be no done. Now what I'm not participating in this, I have no idea where he didn't exactly send over all his files in this one, so there's technically, so there's just going to be me in this particular episode, and that will be it. And what we're trying to do is we're trying to beat this Dynafulse, which is a pain in the arse. Or wants to be. So yeah, this is post commentary. I really am sorry. I really didn't have much of a choice. But we gotta beat this guy in order to proceed on to the next area here. Alright, so what we really gotta do is they made it much more complicated to get to the next um next spot because in the next spot you cannot move in it at all. You are limited in, in terms of time in order to get this. Yeah, see right there? You have to do this within a certain amount of time, which sucks really bad. Because you have to also get it to the mirror where you can get the way forward, of course, but... First thing you really gotta do is actually, you have to get the thing in position first before you can actually move this into position. Because when I first did this, it was more or less, you know, had to do it very quickly, so you have to do this in a certain way, or else you're not going to be able to do it. I think I took a little bit just to try to figure this out, though, but... And yeah. Get a shine right up there. And then... Don't worry about that for now. You gotta move this into position. If you don't do this first, you're screwed. There you go. That's all you need to do. That's all you need to do. And then now you can go ahead and move the light towards the, um... Towards the, um... Mirror. Pardon the delays on this one, because I tried to figure this one out, and it wasn't really easy. But, go ahead and just come back over here. And you got push. You cannot pull these. You got to push. 
That's the sad thing about this thing, is that you gotta push, not pull. And you keep going forward, just push it. Just keep pushing until you're in position. There you go. And you have yourself what you need. Because now it's going out. Now this other... Tre there's a treasure chest in here. Where... Yeah, right here. It's just invisible. Nothing to it, but just you can only access it from the side only. Key. Alright. Alright, so I'm not even sure where this key gets me, but I'm thinking probably to the next area. But we still, even though if we do beat this boss, we still have another whole episode in the Spirit Temple. Just so you know. So, all you gotta do now. And just be aware. Um, shine that, it'll take you down. But be aware of the Wallmaster. Because he will try in. Yeah, watch for the shadows. Yeah, there's a wall mastery. You gotta be careful. Let him come down first. And move out of the way. Be careful, though, because he does come back for another round. Yeah, here, Beeler, be Beeler, Beeler. Come on. You can fight fair. You just don't worry about him. You killed him. So now you can go ahead and destroy the face here. There you go. And there's no gimmick to this. All you gotta do is actually just hook shot across. And you will finally. Yeah, good idea in case. I, what I did with thought was in case there was a. Uh, trick to this, but there wasn't. But the point's back up there, so don't... I'm not gonna worry about that pretty much. So, we go on to hookshot the target here. All you gotta do is hookshot the fence. Right here. Nothing's changed about that. And now we can go ahead and fight the boss. Now, I'm going to go ahead, since this is pretty straightforward, guys, I ain't going to commentate any further. This, nothing is really different about this boss fight. I am actually having a cold right now. I'm very tired. But I just wanted to commentate that first part. So, the rest of this is no commentary. I really got nothing much to say. I'll, I'll try to make it up to you guys later. But for now, I'm just kind of really having a cold right now. I'm really tired. So, I'll let you guys see the rest of this on your own in the next episode of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Um, we will continue the Spirit Temple. We still gotta find four spiders. So, enjoy the fights between Twin Robo and Iron Knuckle here. And I'll see you guys next time. Let's <laughs> go.